Russian forces assigned to the Western Milja district are seen here preparing to cross the Zaversky Donetsk River as part of Russia's change in strategy to regroup its forces in southeastern Ukraine. The Russian generals have been forced to change strategy after its soldiers failed attempts to capture key targets in the Kiev region. The tanks, infantry carriers and logistic vehicles are crossing the river on a pontoon bridge south of Izium in the Kharkov region. The pontoon bridge has been attacked many times by Ukrainian mortars and artillery fire and is under constant repair by Western Military District engineers. The Russian Western Military District Forces offensive in the Kharkiv region is understood to be part of a larger operation to engage Ukrainian forces' defensive positions in the eastern region of Donbass and to link up with Russian forces and the breakaway units of the People's Militia of the Lugansk, Donetsk People's Republics. Russian forces' aim is likely to try and establish full control over the next and Luhansk regions and open a land corridor to Crimea. Towards the end of this video is footage of a Russian Western Military District tank company beginning its assault on a village near Izium. A Western Military District tank company approached the Ukrainian village of Topolska, which is only several miles from Izium, Kharkiv Oblast, Ukraine. According to Russian media, Russian tank crews, supported by maneuverable groups of motorized rifle unit soldiers using handheld and tank grenade launchers, BMP-2 infantry fighting vehicles and BTR-82A armored personnel carriers, captured the village and secured a corridor for the passage of Russian forces. This area has been heavily contested in recent weeks and has changed hands between Russian and Ukrainian forces several times. This war continues with fears of an escalating deadly new phase of fighting in the Donbass region.